Butterflies trace the path Alexis Bounds Road one year ago today. She was riding home from the park um, and she couldn't even get home safely. At 8 o'clock, bicyclists will ride where she rode. So the lanterns are going to be lit up at night and they will light the way for our ride. A memorial bench will join a ghost bike dedicated to her memory. The ride around Washington Park, one year in the making, comes at a time when biking looks to be as popular as ever. It needs to be an experience that anyone can, can partake in, and right now it's not quite there yet. This week, Google said requests for cycling directions jumped by 69% since February. They hit an all-time high last month. Bicycle Colorado. Sure, yeah, Bicycle Colorado is a statewide bicycle advocacy organization. Says biking is booming here at home, citing anecdotal evidence. According to the most recent CDOT data, 20 cyclists were killed statewide in 2019. So far in 2020, the number is seven. That now includes the cyclists killed in a crash on East Hampton in Aurora Thursday night. What we want for just anyone to be able to come out and ride their bikes free of fear. Bicycle Colorado hopes the message is heard statewide, as tonight's visual serves as a reminder that one death remains one too many. We need our friends and neighbors and people that share our community to be looking out for each other and respecting each other. Allie Levine, 9 News.